Hi, my name is Ellie Laveau and today I'm going to be showing you how to do this Victoria's Secret Angels bombshell blowout. Okay, so you're going to start out with washing your hair and then leaving it damp. You're going to grab your blow dryer and a flat brush. Then you're going to section your hair. We're starting at the top and you're going to blow dry it till it's dry and still a little bit warm. And then you're gonna grab a small roller. You're gonna put the roller like an inch away from the ends of your hair. And then you're gonna drag it to the actual ends of your hair and that way it's a bit tighter. And you're gonna roll it away from your face. When your hair is wrapped all around the roller, you'll secure it with a bobby pin. I'm gonna repeat this for three sections on top of my head. When that is all done, I'm gonna take another section very close to my face on the sides and I'm gonna use that same small roller. Okay, now we're gonna move on to some bigger rollers to really ensure that we keep the length of our hair and doesn't curl up too much. I'm gonna start with the section behind the one we just did. Then I'm taking another section under it and I'm taking a bit more hair this time. And then I take another section next to that one. And I'm taking the final section which is the longest part of my hair because I do have layers. So then I have a total of four big rollers on each side of my head. Then you leave these rollers in for as long as you can. I do recommend like at least two hours because otherwise it will just fall flat pretty much immediately. Then it's time to take them out and I'm starting at the bottom because that way you don't get like overlap and accidentally like miss a bobby pin in your hair and it's happened to me before so. And then you're probably gonna look crazy for a little while. So I do recommend to take them out a bit before you are actually leaving. But the reason that I use these like really tight rollers on the top is because throughout the day that is usually like where my hair falls flat. If you however did accidentally take them out too close to like leaving and you need them to be less traumatic immediately, then I recommend getting your flat brush again and then going over it with a blow dryer again and really straightening it out a bit. So yeah, that's pretty much it. It's not that hard actually. And it looks amazing. It looks like really, really high effort, even though it isn't. I hope you liked this video. Let me know what you want to see next. And well, love you, Rex.